Hey, it's really late and I'm totally exhausted. I was thinking today about a couple of comments I've received from a couple of you. Thank you so much for writing in to me. And two beautiful viewers have written to me about how I manage four children and how they're struggling with their children and how do I do it. Sometimes I think it's really important to do a gutsy, uh, raw, real video and in response to their questions saying, how do you do it? I wanted to say, it's really It's really hard to do videos because they keep walking in all the time and I have to keep re-recording. The dynamics with four children. Today, the internet didn't work and then my computer's hard drive blocked up for whatever reason. Then I had a problem with a, a phone bill that I had to sort out. I had a problem with a domain issue and then I had to pick up children from one area, then another area. Then I needed to go shopping three times because we forgot toilet paper. And honestly, you cannot forget toilet paper. So I had to go out and get toilet paper. And then I forgot bananas and I had to go back out because we've got our bananas in the south. And I was so tired. And then I got home and I was so tired and I'd already been to gym. And my daughter said, please, can you support my fitness program? Can we go for a walk? So I went for a walk and it was really wonderful in the night air and really tiring. And then I wanted the boys to do reading, but they had a huge fight about which book they'd read. And so they accidentally tore up a book. And then we had to have a, a talk about the value of books and then they left all their basketball gear out in the library everywhere and they left out a roll they didn't eat so the dog chewed it up and I wasn't happy about that because I was worried about him chewing up plastic and it's really really hot here at the moment and I had several talks in one night about life issues uh, about dynamics with other people and health and fitness and let's see what else did I talk about and I tried to record a video and they kept coming into my room and 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 I'm so tired but you know what I've got through the whole night without getting cross and I really love the quiet at night and it's almost quiet Probably someone will walk in, but it's almost quiet, which is so exciting. And I am really happy about having a cup of tea and my Himalayan salt lamps. And I'm happy that I think this video might be okay. <laughs> and I'm happy because I've got the lunch ready for tomorrow. And I'm happy because my daughter turned to me to talk about her life. I'm happy because I got to walk with one of my daughters. I am happy because in the end, in the end, after so many battles, oh, so many battles, World War Three, finally, my boys read their book. So if you walked into my house, it looks like there's been a tsunami times 10, but it's nighttime now and it's quiet and I feel okay, so how do I do it? One breath at a time, and every so often I do a mummy meltdown, and that's okay. If your children are fed, if you're trying your best, if you love them, if you have a laugh, if you have a cuddle, if you read stories, you're doing okay. You're doing okay, and I reckon, I think, you're doing. You're doing better than I am. <laughs> Four children's a lot, a lot. And I am so lucky. I'm so lucky. Every day I 
think about how lucky I am. So thank you for watching my videos. Thank you for yeah. <laughs> thank you for taking the time to watch this unusual one. Love you all. Lots of kisses and hugs. Sleep well wherever you are.